Nelson Electro Planting. <laughs> Try to say that five times fast. <laughs> Ladies from Jack, there's a statewide APB out on. Jack's okay. He has something up his sleeve. He's not worried about being caught. Not a Jack's week. a thug. <laughs> we go after the other side of the equation. Jack has a lesion and its cronies running scared. Good. We go after the doctor and some of the other guys. Yes. But the whole department breathing down our necks. We it's time this. for action, Herschel. It's time for change. Mm -hmm. Jack's crossed the Rubicon and we have to be on the other side right now. Christ, what was that? Oh my God, it looks Explosion. like an atomic bomb over there. Something Jeez. big. You think it's the Reds? You think those rusky sons of bitches that dropped the H-bomb on us? Calm down. Nah, Herschel. it looks like a plant that blew up. Be ready for the call. I'm not waiting for an invitation. Get in the car and head for the cloud. KGPL can give us the details on the way. I like that Herschel is our partner at the end here. He's perfect for this. Holy shoot. Sorry, Mom. I thought I'd just, like, watch it. <laughs> That's insane. Oh, they're freaking out. Ah. Excuse me. Oh, can I put on my lights? Oh, look how much... Holy shit, dude. Downtown? Can't be. Downtown? What's downtown? Um, I think I shouldn't be back. Um, alright, where is it? I'm going. Oh, look at this. Oh, this was where it was. I was like, oh, look at all this debris. Done, done. Never you said I was smart. Let's get going. 11 k en route. I'm here. Oh my gosh. Absolutely fireproof. Did you see that up there? That irony is, oh, so good. We have looters around the corner. Cut them or put them down. We need to get this area oh, under Jesus. control. Jesus. Wow, people are going absolutely insane. Am I chasing him? Oh yeah, I haven't been chasing him forever. Alright, boys, you got some explaining to do. Are they gonna try to shoot me? Don't make me shoot you. Okay, they want me to shoot them. Okay. I don't really want to, but you left me no choice. Not you, sir. You want to live? Hmm? I don't think he wants to live. Alright, I know you're right there, sir, so... Oh, where'd he go? You ain't gonna get a drop on me, partner. Dude, where the F you go? Catch him, boy! Oh, God. Alright, I was gonna try to not kill you, but... I would have shot you. I thought we were gonna try to keep you alive, but apparently he wanted to die today. So I'm just respecting his wishes. The commander will want us to see. Let's go. Dude, what the heck? Oh, that's why it's called that. That's the name of the place. Jesus, I'd oh. never seen nothing like this. It must have been. I wish a I could say the same. It's like a bomb's gone off. Jesus Christ. Why would a bomb go off? Poor people. We gotta find out what went down. I'm guessing it was on purpose, but for what, I don't know. He wants to keep us off. Oh. Yeah, it was just my shitty driving. <laughs> don't worry about it. What in God's name happened here? Wasn't nuclear. If it was, we'd all be dead from the radiation. It That's was really big, sure. though. What's radiation? Everyone inside the factory was vaporized. Look at the size of that crater. What's going on over there? The mayor is going on television, appealing for calm. Television? We're gonna afford one of those things. Anything to go on? You're looking at the remains of Nicholson electroplating. I have an idea of what might have caused the explosion. But I'm only guessing. What do you think? Have a look around the rubble, see if you come up with anything. All right. It seems a little weird, but I don't know the... They didn't, I don't think there's names come up. upside down. Then it's time for us to do our jobs. All right, relax. There's a lot of ground to cover, you guys. So I don't really see nothing. We have it. Oh. See a shoe. That's sad. 
Poor man lost his shoe in probably his life. I don't really see shit yet, though. There's so much ground to cover. I thought four fix was a tough break. Um, hey, detective! I think I got something here. Another shoe. I don't want to pick up shoes. That makes me depressed. Ooh, who's got something? Oh, look at this. Fundamentals of surface finishing. Well, I can at least explore a game. Don't come at me. Alright, someone called me and they said they found something. What you find, brother? You found what? Ah, uh, here you go. What'd you find, sir? Detective, you seen this yet? Come no. take a look. What is this? Blew the locker open, but shielded the contents. Let's see what we got in here. Oh. Bells. I think I found something over here. Tamako Akamado. Oh. Japanese name. Nice. There's a lot of stuff in here. What is it? Oh. A substitution cipher. The Germans used them in the war. These are cipher rings. I'm not good at this. You know what to do with them? Maybe. I used them in OCS. Equals K. I never can understand, like... His first letters are the cipher key. The rest of the message should align itself. Alright, so like, is it the outer that equals K? Or is it the inner? H equals... K. I think it's the inner, right? Or I don't know. H equals... I'm guessing it's this way, because I can't see the K in the other way, so maybe the game's trying to help me out. <laughs> Ooh, it's, an, it's address. an address. 133 North Vermont Avenue. Whoa, that's sick. Look at this little cute keychain. It's a and little bell. Is Herschel. Ring, ring, ring. None that I care to utter for public consumption. Oh, like kinky stuff? <laughs> A camera. Spy oh, camera. Only OSS Ooh. agents use these things. We'll need to get the film developed to see if there's an espionage angle. Hell yeah, dude. Cool. Nice. Alright. Herschel, you said you found something? Oh, here he is. What'd you find? What'd you find? You fine. Advice? We should search around the edges of the crater, see what the blast tossed up. I thought he found something. He was calling me over. Okay, I'll look around myself then. I didn't find anything else, so I think that's it. I don't really know. You can drive. So, well, what do you want to we'll go to the address. I'm a little uncomfy because the thing isn't crossed out though. But like I ran around and I didn't see nothing, so what are you gonna do? Maybe we come back. I don't know. Hello. Oh someone ransacked the heck out of this place. <gasps> oh boy. They stuffed him in the you fridge. Think I could fit in there? That's nice. I couldn't fit in there. <laughs> I'd like to think you would have had something more to say about getting shoved in a fridge, Herschel. I don't know. I liked his comment. It was pretty good. Somebody turned the place over. We better watch our step. Yeah. He's got a nice watch on. On James Lindbergh. Very expensive watch. Favored by Flyboys. Oh. I always wanted one as a kid. Interesting. That's funny. As a kid, all I wanted was some food on the table. <laughs> Damn. His lines are so good. It looks like they shot him a lot. Oh, look at this ring. It's a nice ring. Could be a class ring. Yeah, it kind of looks like a class ring, huh? Alright. Anything else? Got shot. Oh, whoa. One to the head, one to the heart. Point whoa, blank. that's military, right? Hmm. Alright, well let's see what they 
They probably took whatever they were looking for, but... Oh, they shot him right there. Damn. Boy was just getting a drink. Just got shot in the head. Ooh. Whoa. He was a retired police officer. You know what this is, Biggs? Uh-oh. Sure. The department gives you one of those when you retire. That's not good. That's really not good, actually. We're going into dangerous territory here, boys. Oh, whoa, another one of these bells. Looks like we have a match. Oh, whoa. Interesting dame, this Akamoro. Whoa, what is that? What is it exactly? It's like a blueprint. Microfilm. A document shrunk to the size of your thumbnail. Whoa. Rod must have amazing eyesight. Maybe you can re-enlarge it? Hmm. That's a little crazy. Biggs, page 525. I'll need a couple of black and whites at 133 North Vermont Avenue, Wilshire. Hmm. We'll need an ambulance in the corner. And probably a team from technical services as well. I think that's it. I don't really see anything else. We good here? We good here. Alright. Let's go check out the laundromat. Sad. I'm a little worried that it was a retired cop. That doesn't look good for us. Everything doesn't really look good for us anymore. <laughs> to be fair. We're kind of in You know the way. You can drive. Alright. I don't know what the laundry mat has it to do with anything, but... I know. Maybe they know this, what the guy. What's up, sir? Phelps and Biggs, LAPD. We have one of your laundry tags. Can you tell us who it might belong to? Are you kidding? I got work to do, Mac. Here's the customer book. Knock yourself out. <laughs> so much sass. Jesus. Number was, uh, J2620, Cole. Thank you. And Oscar Hangstrom. Who is Hangstrom? Hangstrom. Could be someone else from the factory. Does he have an address? Um, no. Dead end. No, it's his pickup. Well, thank you for all your help, sir. Mm, all right, I guess we'll see if we can get an address for this guy. Oh, she said they didn't have an address for him. Well, then what now? I don't know where to go. You're behind the wheel. And where exactly are we going? I guess we can only go back. I don't really know. I'm Fred Nicholson. This is your place? What's left oh, of it? Okay. 32 years of work up in Oh, smoke. damn. I was like running around. I was like, what else do I need in this place? Can you tell us what happened here? Our uh, chief chemist, Harold McClellan, was using this area to test the, the new process. Oh, okay. And what exactly is this new process? Uh, that's... Uh, Classified information, son. How is it now? I think I already know. <laughs> um. Hmm. Do I like just go with it or what? I don't know. Okay, sure. We'll need a word. Has anyone accounted for him yet? Not that I've heard, no, but... Look around you, kid. Do you like his chances? Yeah, I knew that was wrong, but I didn't know if I had proof. Who is Tomiko Akamato? Dr. McClellan's personal assistant. Oh. She came highly recommended. <laughs> okay. Do I do bad cop? Sure. Damn it. <laughs> so you hire a chemical whiz kid and his assistant without checking either one of them out. Hindsight is a great thing, detective. And I should have looked more closely at their references. I'm destroying this. <laughs> what can you tell us about McClellan? A brilliant chemist. 
He approached me a few months ago with the idea for the new process. So no one has ever done this before? No, but it is legitimate research. I don't know anymore. Back up, I guess. So you thought McClellan could do what no one else could do. You were prepared to take that risk. Look, he is a... was a trained chemist. And his ideas could revolutionize electroplating. Mm hmm. Mm. And you would be rich. <laughs> yeah. I'm a businessman. What's wrong with turning a buck? You Seems blew up six blocks. God knows how many people are dead. I regret that. That's laudable. <laughs> we'll be in touch. Man, that was hard. Mr. Nicholson. Can you send us Dr. McClellan and Miss Akamato's personnel files? Probably I not. Will if I can find them. Oh, look, there's the police chief. Another corrupt little bee. All right. So they obviously had additional information. And maybe they were working on something outside of that guy's knowledge. Or maybe not. I don't know. But we get to find out why there was a plane part by coming our favorite R&I. Alright, so basically we found out that it's a military part for a plane and there is a location that sells it. So we're gonna go with there, ask the hard questions, and hopefully get some decent answers. Alright, here we go. It's a military project, gentlemen. Can you state your business? Detectives, Phelps and Biggs, LAPD. We're investigating the explosion. We have reason to believe there may be a link to Hughes Aircraft. Mm -hmm. I'm sorry, I can't help you there, detective. Without authorization from Military HQ, you won't be allowed onto this facility. Oh, who's what that? seems to be the problem, gentlemen? Hey, Biggs, you're not still with the LAPD. Right, so, mates. Can you help us out here? Sure. What seems to be the problem? We have some questions. We're working the big explosion at the electroplating plant. We found a part there that belongs to one of your planes. I work head of security for Mr. Hughes now. I'll take full responsibility. I'm sure we can clear this up. Follow me. It's the big hand. You can't miss it. Thanks, brother. Who is Mapes? And what's his connection to Howard Hughes? <laughs> Vernon Mapes used to work advice. Word is he runs fuckpads for Hughes's starlets. A pimp. Earl and Mapes would seem. Ma Oops, sorry. Didn't mean to come off, but we're here. <laughs> Interesting. So maybe they were like testing a bomb and it accidentally Follow went me. off. Or maybe not accidentally at all. Ooh, that'd be interesting. Alright, sir. How the Good heck day, miss. did your plane part get in that building? Can that thing really fly? Mr. Hughes Whoa. believes so. That looks awesome. Amazing. Isn't she? Oh, so, this is the spruce. Group. Jesus Christ, Biggs! You want to get me fired? <laughs> Mr. Hughes hates that fucking name. It's the H4 Hercules to you. You mind answering a few questions, Mr. Mapes? Call me Vernon, kid. Fire away. I like this guy. Probably don't. Probably not gonna do as well at all in this question, so we'll try. Do you know anything about the explosion that happened at Nicholson Electroplating this morning? No more than anyone else. Heard the boom while I was shaving. Almost shit my pants. Thought it was Pearl all over again. Um, I'm gonna, I'm gonna say, back up. But you had no personal contact with any of the employees. And you have no idea what caused the explosion. I'm in security. I handle Mr. Hughes's personal interests, if you get my meaning. I'm not directly involved in manufacturing. Huh. Okay. Do you know Tomiko Akamato? Never heard of the broad. Why? How do you know it was a girl? You don't happen to wear an LAPD tie pin, do you, Mapes? Sometimes. I have a couple of them from my days on the force. Hmm. Do you know the chief chemist at Nicholson Electroplating, a Harold McClellan? I've heard of the guy. He was pitching some fancy process to the company. I'm gonna accuse him. 
but we know that you were sending parts to Nicholson for testing. Question is whether you were going through Nicholson or cutting your own deal with McClellan. Interesting theory, kid. How well, you gonna prove any of We that? found a part at the scene. Like, what do you mean? This right here. We found a prop spinner in the wreckage. We believe it belongs to this aircraft. Uh oh. <laughs> we sent them some aluminum parts to test. Howard and the Boffins were interested in this guy McClellan's theories. McClellan was cutting out Nicholson. That's not our problem. Hmm. Thanks for your help, Mr. Mapes. I have no idea what's going on. Do you mind if we have a look around while we're here? Sure. Knock yourself out. Really? You want to take a look inside her? Hell yeah, dude. And her. Look inside. I have no idea what's going on, though. I'm pretty confused. Um. Little load of these engines. Oh yeah. Keep that cone could have come off one of them. Is that a Pratt and Whitney 4360? Sure is. You know your motors. Do you mind if I take a look at the prop spinner? We're getting her ready for sea trials, so be quick about it. <laughs> oh snap! What is the oily covering on the metal? We coat the aluminum parts in linseed oil to preserve it from oxidization. Oh, nice. Okay. Thanks, good sir. Looks like Mape's office is in the far corner. Let's go see what he's hiding. Okay. What's up in the far corner? Over here? Wait, where? Show me where Briggs over here. What's the exit though? Yeah, no, that doesn't make no sense. What? What did wait, what did he say? Looks like Mel's office is in the far corner. Okay, so his office is upstairs. Okay. Let's check it out. He said he didn't mind, so... Oh, look at this. I don't think it has anything to do with it. Nope. But... It's kind of a weird place for a gun, though, sir. I have no idea who that is. <laughs> it looked like Roy for a second, but then I was like, oh no, that's the other guy. What we got? That is Marie the Body McDonald. Oh yeah? Does Hughes have her on contract at RKO? Yeah, I bet he does. <laughs> nice. Alright. Nothing super juicy yet. Got some sickies. This isn't what we're looking for. Obviously, but I was just interested, game. Eh? Back up. Hmm. That's it? That's it? Really? Nothing spicy in here? That's a bummer. Okay. What now? Are we done? What do you think? What do you say we take a look around inside the plane? Oh, yeah. Let's look in the plane. I want to look in the plane. Hell yeah. In the plane we go. I don't know how that'll help us, but I want to check it out. So. Oh, what's up? Wait, we saw some of those, I think. McClellan's process was going to replace all this. Hmm. Weird. Alright, let's go in here. Hello, says. That looks interesting. Don't mind us, just taking a look around. Oh, I can go up. Hell yeah, let's go. Great. <laughs> Are you scared of height, Briggs? It's alright. 
latitude 24 degrees 15 minutes north, longitude 76 degrees 0 minutes west. What do you want to bet that's where the vac factory is? I bet they dropped the bomb on purpose. It's a test bomb. 76 degrees west. 24 degrees, 15 minutes north. Oh, okay. Alright, let's look again. 26, no, 76, 24, 15. 76 degrees west. 24 degrees, 15 minutes north. Oh, yeah. Let's see where this is exactly. Going into the Bahamas? The Bahamas? What? Somebody's already got their maiden flight planned. That's a little sus. Why are they going to the Bahamas? Let's see what Pinker has for us. He's probably done tinkering with that camera by now. Okay. This one is really weird. And super random from the cases we've been working on. Has nothing to do with the doctor, I don't think. Or the corrupt housing fund or whatever. Thanks for the tour, Mapes. Always happy to help the department. Weird. Hey, don't I know your face from the paper? Probably. You're the cop that's stripping that German broad. Yeah. Nah, I think you got the wrong <laughs> guy. For that's a me. I like how our partner has got our back. He's such a sweet man. All right, well, let's go see the spy stuff. This is really interesting. All right, let's see what Ray got for us. This is such an interesting case. Got some, like, spies. We got some bombs. Like, what the heck? I'm interested to see how this connects or how it plays out, more importantly. It's been a year. All right, where's What's Ray? waiting for? Hey. You think those vice Where's boys Ray? get any on the side? Where's Ray at? I'm at a loss. Best check in at the front desk before we do anything else. Any messages for me, Hopkins? Not many you'd want to hear. <laughs> Newspapers wanting interviews and rookies cussing you out mostly. This guy. Nothing else. <laughs> Pinker wants you in tech services. Maybe you'll be more popular downstairs. This guy freaking hates our guts. <laughs> Grand jury My case God, got thrown damn. out. Now the DA At least everyone else has been pretty nice. I wonder if we'll see Roy again before the end of the game. Probably not, but it'd be kind of crazy if we did. All right, let's talk to him. Hey, Cole. What's up, brother? You're not winning any popularity contests upstairs. You oh, know. I know. <laughs> they all hate my guts. Where do you stand? I think you're a good cop. Aww. But I try and stay out of politics. That's because you lost him, Ray. Stay out of politics, Ray. Well, don't quote me on it. But I'm hoping that Parker will get the job and clean this place up. I have your photographs. Yeah. You can use the magnifier. There's quite a lot of detail. Oh, okay. Sure. Very funny. <laughs> I think you're right, Ray. We have our man. <laughs> we take a nice photo, Phelps. Oh, that's awesome. He's so cute. Okay. Not really. Oh, here we go. Oh, the watch. Bringing the watch or a match for our John Doe. Oh. He's obviously the competitive bid. Interesting. Can you get this over to Lockheed so we can get a name for this guy? It's already on its way. Okay. Interesting. Howard Hughes. Millionaire, industrialist, aviator, oh, and playboy, the... and Vernon Mapes, ex-dirty cop, it's a little thingy. business fixer. Look at that. I found a similar tie mm -hmm. pin along with a dead guy in a fridge. Mm-hmm. Don't look good for you, sir. Oh my god. Whoa. Formula of some kind. Excellent photography, Tomiko. So Tomiko had the goods on McClellan. Too bad they blew the place to hell. Mm. Okay. This one's so weird. We got. Oh. 
Is this McClellan? What in the heck? Can anyone make out the street number behind him? Are you kidding? With my eyesight? It's West something. It's behind him. Interesting. So obviously he lied about knowing him. Oh, there it is. Nice. Let's go investigate that house. Cole, can you help me with a little experiment? Of course I can. Use the eyedropper in front of you. One drop from each of the bottles on the desk. Place the drops in the Petri dish. Okay, why is he smirking like that? <laughs> yeah, the bum took a swipe at me. Put him down with my sap. It says warning on that bottle. I don't really want to do this. It says warning on the bottle. <laughs> That's why he was smirking. He blew off my it's hat. Okay, guys. Just a little experiment. Can you guys knock it off? Everyone's still <laughs> jumping from that bang this morning. Very funny, Ray. You just That's took a awesome. couple years off my life expectancy. Did the same trick to me about an hour ago. <laughs> so that Smells was like this guy. <laughs> I think so. Acetic anhydride is almost as explosive as nitro, and when mixed with perchloric acid, it's very unstable. It needs to be hmm. cooled constantly. We used linseed oil. You could add any organic compound to trigger an explosion. Three little Interesting. drops. Interesting. Yeah. And they were using a hundred gallon vat. Oh. Damn. All right, is that it? Can I bounce? All right, I think I can bounce. Pick up my hat. <laughs> um, I think that's it. All right, let's go to the house in the photograph. Say hello to the mistress. We're a real charmer. We can get all the ladies if we want. Might as well, our reputation's already shit. <laughs> all right. Hopefully there's some evidence here, because his office really didn't have any. Oh, they're pulling out the guns. Oh, the door's open. That's not good. Hello? Oh, this place is wrecked AF. This place stinks of petroleum. Avgas, if I'm not mistaken. Hmm. It's all around the floor. Hmm. Oh, yeah, look at that. What is going on here? Why is there gas on the floor? What do we got? Oh, a tourist. Angstrom is flying today on TWA. Oh, he's going to Bahama. Angstrom is <laughs> dead, Cole. Why leave your ticket behind? Nips is cleaning up. Maybe he's not dead. Oh, wait, that's the. Yeah, he's dead. Never mind. <laughs> Just kidding. Oh, look at that. Hangstrom and McClellan are the same man. <gasps> oh. The gas, Cole, the gas! That we gotta get out of here right now! Awesome. <laughs> oh, shit. Um, um, look, by the stove! Shoot the gas line, Cole! We're out of here! Let's go! <laughs> he tried to murder us. Fuck. Hi! There you are, How are you? Come on! He's not getting away from us! An old officer. The betrayer. Car, you're in the way, sir. All the cars are in the way. Jeez. There he is. Alright, excuse me, ma'am. Thanks. Don't want to be a murderer. There he is. You won't get away with this, sir. Oh, shit. I'm gonna shoot his tires. You gotta get me closer! Oh my god, what the fuck was that, game? Aw, oh, you guys. I swear it wasn't me. The game, like, glitched. Damn it. Maybe I can still get on. I don't 
don't think so. We'll try. Oh shit. Ooh, bro. I lost him. Damn it. Alright, we got him, boys. Stop right there! Get out of the car slowly. Oh, we're gonna have a shootout, aren't we? We're gonna I'm have down. to go through all the security men first. I hope you're ready for a fight, Cole. Oh, I was born ready. Come on. Let's talk about this. I'm so God damn it. Say hello. Come on. Stay in right, cover. Fine. I'll come to you. I'll come to you, sir. This one over here. Hand. What did I say about knocking off my hands, boys? It's not allowed. Come on. Come on. Come on. Oh, you trick me. Come on. Got him. Ooh, that was so cool. Someone behind me? You alright? There you go. Alright, one boy left. Where is she at? Where is she at? Tell a you are, sir. Bye bye. Hell yeah, let's go. Let's go and get his ass. Yeah, let's go get him. I'm ready. I'm scared. Where you at, brother? Of course, he has friends. Naturally, he has friends. Way too many of them. It's ridiculous. Lay down some cover and fire. Come on. Say hello again. Come on. Stay in cover. Got him. Oh, there's way too much fighting. Right Jesus, this is ridiculous. <laughs> All right, boys. I'm tired of this. Aren't you tired? Find a war you don't know what you're fighting for. Ow, who's shooting Who's doing it? Hello? Who's shooting me? Oh, that's right. Get out of here, sir. Oh! <laughs> that was awesome. There's so many of them. Why is there so many? This is illegal. Um, almost died, but that's it. Right Alright. I need cover! I got 
hit him from this way. Guys, that was so much fighting. That was ridiculous. Oh my god. All right, sir, give it up. I killed like 50 men, You're so. Have to explain this to me again. So the guy at the chemical the this plant, guy? he's planning on selling his magic formula to another company and skipping town with his assistant, but he mm -hmm. blows himself up before he can manage it. So why the dead body in the refrigerator? Mapes, Captain. Yeah. He was eliminating all competitors for the process. Mm -hmm. When it went bang, he burnt down the apartment to remove all connection between Hughes and the plant. Mapes, right. I remember Vernon Mapes. <laughs> the guy had good, honest cops hanging their heads in shame. Glad he's finally out of commission. Oh, is that the guy on the roof? Uh, that makes sense. I don't know if it'll do you any good, Phelps. What? But between the spruce goose and half the city exploding you might just have made the case of the decade oh yeah not yet that's the next one i bet <laughs> that was a really cool case i i was kind of confused why it was there um but still pretty cool good morning doctor and a good oh, morning to whoa. you too elsa you look radiant. Thank you, Doctor. Interesting. We haven't been seeing much of you lately, Elsa. You've been missing appointments. I'm sorry, Doctor. I've been feeling much better. That's very good to hear. And what has brought about this improvement? It's the new man in my life. He's convinced me to fight my addiction. Ah, the oh, policeman yeah. from the newspapers. How has he coped with his fall from grace? He can finally see things from a human perspective. Rather than the ivory tower he created for himself. <laughs> it's making him stronger. It's making me stronger helping you. Oh. You wouldn't make a bad analyst yourself, Elsa. Should we swap seats? No thanks. <laughs> We're both finding we have a lot to live up to. And what is that? In my case, Blue. He went through hell along with me and still came out smiling. In Cole's case, his friend. Kelso. Kelso? Yeah. You've heard of him? Uh oh. No, uh, I just like the sound of his name. Oh, yeah. Paul okay. and Jack are working <laughs> on a case together. Is Jack a policeman, too? No. He works for the district attorney. What? He's a special investigator. I thought you didn't know him. The doc's I have never met the gentleman in question. <laughs> he has been looking into Lou's case. Cole thinks it might be linked to some fires he's investigating. You look pale, Doctor. Oh, yeah. It's cold in here, Elsa. Oh, it's gonna be freezing. Close the window. Uh oh. He's gonna kill Elsa. Elsa, run. He's crazy. Why are you looking at me like that, Elsa? You arranged for Lou to work at Elysian Fields, Doctor. Your fears are unfounded. No, they're not. I meet many people in my line of work. Oh, she's dead. There are dead. many ways that people can be helped. Part of them work is just one of them. I don't believe you, Doctor. I've seen you with Monroe at the club. I'm sorry that you have come to that conclusion, Elsa. Uh-oh. Uh-oh. Bye-bye. I've always so enjoyed a conversation. <laughs> I can see your future, Elsa. And Cole, the policeman. And Jack, the investigator. It's an unfortunate and grisly end. Oh, 
that's so juicy. <laughs> I've come to help you, Doctor. To help you cross over. All your sins will be forgiven. The next slide. Holy sh- Alright guys, we're gonna end that one there. Um, I think the next case will be the last case of the game, so I'm sure it's gonna be intense. It looks like the guy that was starting all the fires just murdered the doctor, which like, I don't feel too bad about. Um, but I don't know if I really want to go against that guy, because that guy has definitely lost all of his marbles. Um, but I'm excited to see how this ends. It's been a long journey but a really amazing one and i'm very excited to see how they wrap this up so get ready for next time but other than that i hope you guys enjoyed this part if you did go leave a like and comment below and of course subscribe to see this gameplay and the gameplay in the future but other than that i hope you have an amazing rest of your day and i'll see you guys in the next one bye